And tonight at 6, look at your TV. You recognize these people? Police in Columbus say these two planted a skimmer at the place that you're supposed to feel the safest with your money, the bank. Tonight, the rush is on to find out who those two are and where they're hiding. And as Rich Van Wyke explains, this is not the only crime that police say they're connected to. Here in downtown Columbus, police discovered an elaborate operation, skimming credit cards and making new ones. They have one victim, one suspect in jail they can't identify, and two others still on the run. Customers using this ATM apparently had no idea thieves were nearby, stealing their credit card information, even watching them enter their personal identification numbers. And these suspects were using a Bluetooth camera, a very small camera, to uh, video people putting their PIN codes in on this ATM machine. A bank employee found the credit card skimmer Sunday during a routine check of the ATM. Police later found the tiny camera hidden in a metal strip attached to the machine. In the suspect's hotel rooms, police found an assortment of electronics capable, they say, of using the stolen information to make new credit cards. It appears that, you know, with how elaborate things are, that this isn't the first time that, that they've done this. Police say the suspects were in town for several days, maybe a week, and bought things from local stores using at least one credit card made from the stolen information. That's really scary. Sarah Goldman is a mom who uses her credit cards a lot. Seems like they could just get a job in that amount of time for the effort that they're putting into it. The jailed suspect has two European ID cards. Police don't know who he is. And is he cooperating at all? Um, not really, no. Investigators believe the other two suspects, a man and a woman, left town and hope someone recognizes them. They are warning consumers to check their credit card bills. The one victim in Columbus so far had no idea they were a victim until random purchases started showing up on that credit card bill. Scott, Ann? Thanks, Rich. Well, there are several easy things you can do tonight to check for skimmers. First, check for tampering. Does anything look out of place? Are there parts sticking out? Take a look around. Does the machine look like the others in the area? If it looks a little different, make sure you report it and go somewhere else. Also, wiggle and push everything. ATMs are designed to be pretty sturdy, so there shouldn't be any jiggling or moving parts. If there are, that's a sign there could be a skimming device inside. And some common sense. Just make sure you're avoiding ATMs and gas pumps that are in secluded or some areas that are poorly lit. Skimmers target these spots because it's less likely for them to get caught while they install the device. Also, if you think you found a skimmer, make sure you report it right away. That way you can help save someone else from being a victim.